Here are some common misconceptions about the Session Private Messenger. This video is brought to you by PrivacyProShop.com, where you can buy truly anonymous, high-performance LokiNet VPN access. Purchase them anonymously by using cryptocurrencies. You may also choose to use credit cards. That Session is a copy of Signal. Well, it's partially true. Session uses a lot of code from Signal, but the main protocol the core of Session is its own Session protocol. Session used to use the Signal protocol up until late 2020, but it was replaced by the Session protocol because it is much better suited for the decentralized system that Session is. Session is completely decentralized. Well, no it isn't. Session depends on centralized bootstrap servers or seed nodes. Those servers are run by the Oxen Privacy Tech Foundation, or OPTF, and in some way they are gatekeepers to Session. If you can't reach them, you can't use Session. In the fall of 2022, the Iranian government blocked the Session seed node servers and therefore blocked access to our Iranians to using Session unless they were using a VPN. Also, file attachments in Session require a centralized server. The OPTF runs them too and limits the attachment size to 6 megabytes. Also, Session peer-to-peer -peer calling requires OPTF's centralized WebRTC signaling server. Session will never reveal my IP address to a third party. Well, that's true as long as you don't use Session for voice or video calls. If you use Session for voice or video calls, your IP address is revealed to the party you call, as well as the centralized WebRTC signaling server run by the Oxen Privacy Tech Foundation. Official Session app is available on F-Droid. No, it isn't. The official Session app has Google's Firebase code in it for notifications. The F-Droid version of Session removes the Google Firebase code. However, this version is not compiled by the official Session team. The official Session team provides a repository that can be added to F-Droid. The name I choose when I set up Session is the name that I can be contacted with. No, it isn't. That's just the display name. There are only two ways you can be contacted on Session. Number one is your Session ID, that long 66 character hexadecimal string. Or your Session ONS name that links to your Session ID. To get a Session ONS name, you'd have to buy it. If you own Oxen Cryptocurrency, you can just open the Oxen Wallet and purchase a name you like. If you don't have Oxen Cryptocurrency, you can go to privacyproshop.com and purchase a name for yourself with other cryptos or even a credit card. Group calling is coming to session in the future. Maybe, maybe not. Group calls require a centralized server that has lots of bandwidth in order to make the calls work. And all of the call participants' IP addresses will be exposed to that centralized server. So it wouldn't be a privacy-friendly add-on to Session. However, it certainly would be convenient for a lot of people. Session groups are ideal for large groups for private messaging. Not yet. At the moment, Session groups are limited to 100 members. There are plans to increase that, but for right now, the limit is 100 members. Session communities offer a private, secure discussion forum. Nope. Session communities, which are formerly called session open groups, can be joined by anyone without authentication. They are just that, communities for people to discuss things anonymously, but without any privacy or security. Many session communities even publish the contents of the discussions on a public website. Session runs over LokiNet. Nope, it doesn't. Session uses its own version of Onion routing called Onion Requests to accomplish the anonymity benefits. There are plans to move Session to use LokiNet in the future, but that still weighs off. 
moving session to Lokinet would make it possible to have anonymous voice and video calls within session. It would also likely improve the speed of session. Session is built in Australia, so it isn't secure. Australia has some anti-privacy and pro-surveillance laws, and it is a Five Eyes surveillance country. However, Session is secure because it is an open source app, and the Oxen network is a decentralized network of 1,800 nodes all around the world. The Session team has no access to these servers and has no control over them as they are run by those who participate in the Oxen network by staking the Oxen cryptocurrency in these service nodes. So there's no need to worry. Session is and will be secure. Session saves your messages forever in the Oxen blockchain. Nope. Your messages are kept in a collection of Oxen service nodes called a swarm for up to two weeks. Once the message age reaches two weeks, the message will be deleted. The messages are stored end-to-end -end encrypted, so only you can read your messages. Without the message storage, you'd have to have session open all the time to be able to receive messages. The Oxen blockchain, however, is used to keep those Oxen naming system names, the ONS names for session. So if you choose to purchase a session name, that name will be stored in the blockchain. Session is a scam because it's built on a cryptocurrency network. Nope. Session uses the Oxen network for routing and storing messages. And the Oxen crypto is, is used to pay the service node operators so that they have an incentive to keep the network running. Without the crypto backing, Session would not exist. Without the crypto staking integration, a large operator could simply buy enough nodes to control a majority of the network and therefore session would be more easily compromised. With the crypto integration, this type of attack, it's also called a Sybil attack, the cost of it would be very high and would drive up the price of the Oxen cryptocurrency and therefore would be easily detected. Did you know that Lokinet exit nodes make you truly anonymous on the internet? Traditional VPN is not anonymous. The VPN provider knows your IP address. With Lokinet's onion routed network, nobody but you knows what your IP address is. You can subscribe to high performance Lokinet VPN service at privacyproshop.com. Also, try the anonymous VPN service for just $1. Thank you for supporting this channel.